Hey everyone, today is uh, September 20th, uh, 2021, and the time is 3.55 p.m. Central Time, and finally the iOS has been released to the public. Uh, as you know, Apple blocked every single ICC ID since Friday uh, midnight, uh, Friday, September the 17th at uh, midnight. Uh, they shut down the ICC ID uh, unlocks. So that means uh, we cannot unlock any iPhone via ICC ID anymore. Um, so we need to look for new ways, new uh, methods, new uh, solutions. Uh, and we need to move forward now. So today I'm gonna be using the new Gaby Pro uh, version 14.2 5G mode. Uh, this is the one you can get it on my website. And there is an ICC ID, but it's not for the same unlock that we used to do. This is gonna be for the ICC ID for the cipher mode for the KB Pro, okay? So don't confuse the ICC ID is listed on my website. And if you're trying to do a new active a new a SIM activation or unlock uh, using the SIM the ICC ID, uh, unfortunately you will keep getting SIM not supported because Apple blocked the exploit. Okay, so in this iPhone it is an Sprint iPhone, uh, Sprint XR, and it is with a clean clean IMA number. Uh, this is my website. If you need a, a, an active ICC ID for cyber mode only, as you can see here, that's the one that is working right now. If something happened to that, uh, I will be posting a new one. Also, I have, if you are just for customers, I have another solution, uh, but that I cannot display the number. That's only gonna be for customers. When you make the purchase, uh, it will, uh, um, there will be a number for you to contact me directly. Uh, with the kind of product, but it's coming soon. Uh, I already did a couple of tests uh, on iOS 15 beta 9, and this afternoon uh, on the iOS um, 15, the official release, which was like a few hours away, a few hours back. Um, so whatever you need, uh, here's my website. There is the XCC number, uh, the XCC ID number working for the cyber mode for the KB Pro. You can go get it there. Okay, this is all the product, and you see all my, unfortunately, well, I had to take out all my smart cards, except one, I got good news, uh, but it's a little bit tricky, you might need to do some work. Uh, also, with the Gaby Pro, uh, it's no longer plug and play, you might need to do some configuration, uh, I know that you're not used to it, uh, and it's a little bit confusing sometimes, but please follow me, follow my steps so you can have a successful SIM unlock. Uh, like I said, this is gonna take you some time. Uh, do not rush it, take your time uh, and enjoy the ride. It's, it's gonna be fun. Uh, I'll be providing, like I said, the ICC ID, you can get it from my website. Let me just copy my, copy, copy, cause I'm gonna need that one. So let's begin then. So my iPhone, it is an iPhone XR. Uh, running iOS 15 official release, which is uh, 19A346. Uh, and my iPhone, it is SIM locked. And here's the description. And it is SIM locked to a Sprint. And for the Gaby Pro, for this new unlock, you need an AT&T SIM card. It has, uh, it doesn't mean that it has to be active. Uh, you can use, an, uh, in my case, for my test, I had to go and uh, get a prepaid plan, the cheapest one, uh, to test it, and it works. So I'm not saying that you have to go and purchase a, 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 a prepaid plan, but if you have a, a, a friend, or if you have a active uh, AT&T chip, uh, or prepay, or any kind of AT&T chip, it will help you a lot okay so this is my uh, new active plan that i got um yesterday and here's my gaby pro so let's begin so i'm gonna open my gaby pro and yes we have to do some configurations okay so this is uh, gonna be easy it's gonna take some time okay but it's gonna be worth it trust me so here's my gaby pro 
this is my sim tray i'm gonna grab my gaby pro and be careful with this because they're very fragile uh, these are not designed to be reused uh, these are supposed to be meant to be fold in and plug it in and you're supposed to leave it inside at all times in order for you to get service but with this new method you don't have to do that um, if you are carefully with the gaby pro you can unlock at least one or two iphones uh, before you damage the gaby pro okay and so if if you notice the gaby pro when you put it in your sim tray uh you need a, you need the whole gaby pro for the iphone xs all the way to the 12 pro max uh, and you need half of it uh, for the iphone 7 through the x and the new se 2020 you need a half you need half of the uh half of the uh gaby okay but for this one we need the whole piece and it's like a sandwich it wraps between your sim card and like i said mine is a at&t sim card and this is what i'm going let me go to my website once again and i'm going to copy the icc id because we're going to need it i'm going to put it in if you're forcing it your way in that means you didn't put it correctly and take it out it has to be like a really smooth because if, if you get too rough or if something happened to it you might damage the uh the gaby pro so oops let me go back Seriously. Okay. This is the menu for the KB Pro version 14.2 for 5G. Uh, the options we're going to choose cyber mode. Uh, second option cyber mode manual 2 or 1. You can choose either or. If uh, cyber manual 2 is not working for you, uh, you can go back and switch to some, uh, manual 2. In my case, I've been using manual 2 with no problems. Uh, this is the, the one of the ICC ID numbers that is on the KB Pro. Uh, unfortunately, this one, it changed. So we need to delete it. And I'm going to paste the one I copied from my website. 0651. So I'm going to hit send. See, this takes time. If you don't do it fast, it will take you back to the uh, to the original menu. So cyber mode, cyber mode, cyber manual two. The same ID appears. The same the ICC number appears. So I need to change it and put mine that is on my website. Ending zero six five one. Send. Okay. I'm gonna wait for a little to the signal. The signal is supposed to. There we go. I'm going to wait for the signal. And then. There you go. It went away. I don't know. You can see it. So my signal went away. I'm just going to let it rest here for a few, a few seconds. Hopefully it doesn't take long to this for the signal to come back if you don't see no changes just hit continue like you like you normally do and hopefully this time it doesn't ask for or doesn't show sim not supported oh, there we go so it takes you right away to the activation screen or the uh, iphone unlock so what i usually do device passcode my passcode on my device two to three times and as you can see it still had no signal right I just need to wait for my iPhone remains active or on the home screen gonna close everything and like I said I copy and paste the dice ID on my website and then 0651 something happened just go back to my website if any ICC ID change 
uh, you will see it on my website but uh, on this method it's gonna be really uh, it won't be changing as much as the other method so it will be remain the same uh, for a couple of months at least or weeks hopefully months but uh, my iPhone remains uh, on the active on, on unlock what we can do next is go to general about this is the moment of truth iOS 15 XR and now my phone says sim no restrictions and it's running on AT&T network see it is kind of the same process doing the ICC ID unlock uh, but in this case you have to do a little configuration uh, it's not like the same as the other one that you just plug in and continue so very carefully once I use my Gaby Pro and when I said uh, this is not supposed to be uh, reusable is because the material you can damage it really easily if you damage any of these uh, six pins on the bottom or top any minor scratches on the little metal um, you not be able to use the Gaby Pro you might need to purchase another one so that's why I'm saying if you need to do a couple of iPhones, do it very carefully uh, or get get two at one, buy two and then you write for at least a few phones. But if you're carefully, you can mm, use this many times as you want. But like I said, these are not meant to be reusable. OK. OK. Now go back to my no graph, my AT&T. So it's picking up the signal. Let's make a test call real quick. And I'm gonna say AT&T prepaid. Like I said, I- Welcome to AT&T prepaid. Para Espanol, marca nueve. Okay, so my phone has been successfully semi-factory unlocked. So my phone is ready to be activated with any network, but please make sure you check your network before you uh, because even though the iPhone can be unlocked, the iPhone cannot be compatible with other networks, especially Boost Mobile uh, and other networks that I know. So you just check with them first to make sure if they're going to be compatible or not. If not, you're, safe, uh, you're more than welcome to try Cricket, Metro, all the prepaids, prepaid AT&T, prepaid uh, T-Mobile, prepaid Verizon. Um, H2 Wireless, US Mobile, Visible, uh, that's the major uh, prepaid ones. Uh, I never use SafeLink, uh, TrackPhone, or one of those Walmart family plans, uh, or Boost Mobile, because Boost Mobile still remains on CDMA. Uh, you may not be able to use it, but uh, just be aware of that, okay? But it is working, this method is working, so go for it. I'm gonna leave, leave the, the link for my website so you can get this from. Uh, and I only do support for my customers. If you um, you don't see any comments when somebody asks on my YouTube channel, that's because uh, unfortunately, with this new change, I be getting a lot of emails, a lot of text messages, a lot of phone calls from other people that they make the purchase with a different seller and now they're not responding. So they're turning to me, but uh, I'm not able to take care of every single one. I only take care of my customers. If you send me a text message, I'm going to reply and I'm going to ask you, hey, when did you purchase this? I need to see the order number. Don't get mad. It is what it is. I just cannot fix others. I need I need to take care of my customers first, okay? See, don't, don't get mad with me, okay? Well, this method is working. Go for it. Uh, any questions, let me know. Like and share. Uh, and hopefully, when I reach 1,000 subscribers on my YouTube channel, uh, I can go, I can give a, 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 I'm planning to do a giveaway uh, to the U.S., uh, anybody in the U.S. Uh, I have a brand new, uh, 
AirPod Pro 3, uh, the 3 Gen. This is a copy, it's a copy A. It is basically the same as the, uh, same as the new ones, uh, you know what I mean? But I can get this uh, when I reach 1,000 subscribers. Please like and share, and I can do like a raffle, or but only if people in the US uh, can win this, okay? Or it can be something else. By the time I reach my 1,000 subscribers, it can be something else. It can be an iPhone. I don't know. I need to think about it, but uh, help me out. Let's spread out the word. Uh, we are DJ's uh, shop, and we will be doing we have been doing this for more than 10 years we know how this work uh, we're here for you guys customers comes first uh, and hope you like my videos okay well we'll keep in touch for new methods and uh, and other solutions